Our Department of Critical Studies at UBC Okanagan was established deliberately to push the boundaries of traditional arts and humanities based subjects. It's a really good combination of cultural studies and language, I felt. It gives me the opportunity to, to think critically and, and, um, and apply that knowledge to the real world. It really gears you towards understanding different perspectives. A lot of interesting discussion takes place. The way we think about nature also affects the way we act in it. I was able to communicate with more people. But also to discover a new culture. Our programs in cultural studies, in English, art history, French and Spanish, and our courses in German and Japanese, they allow us to learn and teach about issues from a truly global perspective. The literature part of English, that, can, uh, that allows me to discover where the language origins from. I teach indigenous literature, which is literature is authored by First Peoples in North America. Some of the courses that I teach are about animals um, and how we represent and think about animals, particularly dogs and whales and chimpanzees, and how they show up in books and films. The greatest part about cultural studies is the fact that it's interdisciplinary and there is almost no limits on what you can do in the program. Art history and visual culture is one of the most exciting ways to learn about diverse cultures and how we're all connected to each other. We get to build uh, new innovative databases, we build 3D models. We really take a different approach to art history at this campus. What we're able to do is see the relationship between uh, people, places, and the uh, events that they were uh, a part of. You probably can't read, you know, 5,000 novels that were written in the 19th century, but you could use an algorithm to look for patterns within them and maybe learn something about that larger corpus. That's the kind of stuff we're up to in the digital humanities. With the French club at the university, we organize some events like movie screening of French movie, uh, but also cooking, game in French. Uh, we also work with the um, French community in Kelowna. Les étudiants peuvent continuer à apprendre le français dans des cours de langue, des cours de littérature, de culture. They have the opportunity to go abroad and study in a francophone country for one or two semesters. Since I joined the Spanish program here, it's inspired me to, to go to Spain to immerse myself more into the culture. Taking a language course isn't just, you know, learning translations and stuff. It's a lot more than that. There's a lot of depth to it. And a lot of cultural significance. Or knowing different um, cultural expectations as well was really helpful, so it wasn't just strictly language. You're guaranteed to have a very well-grounded understanding of how different people see the world. I think it's a, it's a fantastic opportunity for students to be here. Well, just explore a little and you never know what you might discover, like I did.